Good morning. It's Tuesday and this is where I said last night. It was raining all night, but look at it this morning. The sun is out. Look at them. The mountain is blue. Sun's out. We're going home today. It's 9.30 a.m. now. We've got a long drive. I've just started the engine first fit first thing make sure it's not dead the battery we are going home i need to have a bit of breakfast then we'll start the drive it's been a wonderful trip here in scotland i'm having a little spot of porridge and tea before we leave for the big journey i've no milk left because the milk head in the cool box is all gone funny and smelly and sushi like slushy slushy sushi and uh yeah i've just got some balsam water in the pan this is porridge original porridge Nice and easy, tea for done, and a brew, black brew, and uh, yeah, we'll be off. In the meantime, I think, like, because we're driving driving through Glencore and the mountains, I'm going to put the GoPro on the car again, on the roof, so I think it should be fantastic, you know. we got butterfly. There we go, butterfly. Did you see that? Just put in the clamp on the car, ready for the Highland Drive with the GoPro, and uh, looking to get one final... A lot of footage in this beautiful weather. Days like this makes me want to stay stay here actually. If it weren't for the battery issue, I would con consider staying longer. Or maybe I've just, uh, you know, maybe I just want to go back because I, I could have got a new battery if I was serious. Uh, the lock, you can see it from here. It's down there. You can see it there. But for now, I'm going to get my stuff ready. Finish this cup of tea and I'm gonna get off. I haven't got enough fuel in to get home, so I need to put some in at some point. So I need to decide that that's the only thing that's stopping us from doing a clear run. If I leave now, I'm getting home with no brakes about half past seven at night. So I really need to make a move. The battery's gone again. Oh my God. Talk about super annoying. Flat battery again. After all the driving yesterday, and I've only been parked overnight, and it won't even start again. I really wanted to get, you know, move on. So I've got a long way to drive home. This is twice now. We've been out here seven days. After the first day, it only just started. So I think if I can get a new battery, no, I should do it rather than hang around. Even though I'm going home, at least I'm getting the battery sorted. But at least it isn't in the rain or anything. This is beautiful. And I'm, I'm going to really try and get some answers from this mechanic. How was it starting this morning? 9.30 a.m. And 10.30 a.m. I've opened a few doors. Done this, done that. Lights have come on. It won't start again. This battery cannot handle it. After all the driving yesterday, it's not holding a charge. Feeling a bit cheesed off again. But there's always something, isn't there? It all makes it a story. It all makes it fun. I a text message to come in before 11.55 a.m. which is um, it's around quarter past 11 now. Views are missing out on the beautiful views of this lock. What a beautiful day. And also what I've learned as well, it's meant to be rainy today. Super rainy. But it's not. It was meant to be rainy on Sunday. But it was beautiful. I went on the walk to the lighthouse. So I think another thing I've learned is take the weather forecast with a pinch of salt. If you're going to do a trip, just do it. Don't get scared by the weather. You go home because it's going to rain in. And you have days like this. You'll kick yourself. I know I would. I have so much frustration in me right now. It's uh, it's put a dampener on, which has been a, a wonderful trip. I'm sure today will turn out fine. It's uh, it's all good. This journey continues. All right, great start again. This nice young, young man, this tire guy. He's just leaving. Um, so pretty much these days are battery and uh, I just need to get home really and start driving, driving to Stirling.
driving for like two hours from Lenko and um, hopefully to get a new battery fitted I need to do this ASAP fuel in and then head back on the motorway towards England and home <laughs> Sink in, new batteries in, we're gonna test it. Let's do it. It started. All okay? Yeah. Thank God I'm over there. Hopefully now be alright. I think it's a 111 pound and 25 pound fitting. Gets the job done. Alright, I'm at Shell Garage, I've got a full tank of fuel now, new battery in here at uh, Sterling. We've got seven hours of a journey to go, um, no hanging around. We're going to hit the road and uh, drive for a couple more hours but it's uh, I feel much better, battery's been changed and um, full power again. Mm -hmm. 